Hello, Amber Stokes again, and I am reflecting on my how-to video and uh, just how that whole process went. Actually making the videos of how, well, my video was on how to make slime, and I think that making the video itself was pretty simple because it was basically, I just had a recipe, I was showing each step in clips as I was doing it. The difficulty I had, or that I found, was when I was actually trying to get all of my clips put together in a video. The Screencast-O-Matic version that the students are able to get, um, the free version, it doesn't allow you to conjoin, it doesn't allow you to add multiple clips. Uh, so I had trouble and had to be creative in how to get all of this together. I actually ended up uploading the videos onto Google and then making a movie out of the clips. So that's what I'm going to have to submit. Um, so, but the task itself was okay. The difficulty was in using the post-production software to try to get the assignment completed. As far as um, typing out the script and everything, what I actually ended up doing was uh, taking my video and holding it up to the mic on my computer and allowing it to dictate to Google Documents and it typed out my script for me. I learned this after I had already tried typing out a couple of them on my own and it was just so tedious and I'm like, why am I doing this? Today's technology, I should just, you know, let it talk and dictate at the same time. Um, so I think as far as what I did well, uh, I think the actual, act, the video itself, as far as me making the slime, me and my daughter making the slime, that went well. I was a little frustrated when I was trying to make the video just because it had been, it was the end of the day and I was tired and um, I probably should have waited until I was in a better mood. But I think overall um, the task itself was good and my daughter loved it. She is still playing with the slime today. Um, so let's see what surprised me. I think what surprised me was, well, okay, so while we're not able to join different clips, the program does still give you lots of different options for editing your videos. So I was actually pretty surprised that for a free version of a software, how much versatility and creativity it gives the user. And even to subscribe to this software, it would be like $24 for the year for a teacher subscription. And I think that's fantastic. I would gladly pay that if I felt like I was going to use this uh, for more than just this one class. But I think overall, the assignment was really fun. I enjoyed doing it, and now I know how to make slime. Thanks.